Here we go live again. I'm gonna try to upload all of these lives and I'm going to write something down right now. Stop stalling. Start starting. These might be the secrets to life. Go. Stop stalling. <laughs> Start starting. That's what I'm doing. Starting. And I'm keep, I was going to do little drawings in here for Morton. I'm writing little words in here for Morton and for me. <laughs> good morning. I am Priscilla. I'm actually good afternoon. It's 1.32 in France. Orquivo. Chateau Orquivo. Chateau Orquivo. And uh, I'm illustrating a book, writing and illustrating a book. This is Spring Fairies, and it's one of my fairy tales about the four seasons. The first one is Lady of the Leaves, available on Amazon. Second one is The Real Jack Frost, available on Amazon. And this one, this one, these are both, I love them. I, I'm in love with them, both of them. <laughs> And this one is gonna be so special because we're actually creating this at a French chateau. We are in France for the whole month of February. And I have my phone just about right. That's just about right. Now, last night I drew um, this, this little sketch, little sketch for the first page. And um, hopefully I'm gonna be able to upload all these to our YouTube. Um, so you can learn how to write and illustrate your own books. And this one, um, I'm doing my line art. And when I left off, just before I went to have lunch, which was delicious, <laughs> I mean, come on, it's French chefs in a French chateau. Before I start, I will, I'll give you a little tour around. Um, the view from my window, my writing desk, the picture of a church above my desk, and I live in a church in Pennsylvania, but for the next month, this is our home. When I say our home, I mean me and you, <laughs> because you're on this trip with me. <laughs> and uh, we just have incredible views. There's 25 artists here, and I am just, I'm happy beyond belief. And I'm, Really happy that you're here sharing this experience with me. Thank you for that. So without any further ado, I'm going to get illustrating because what did I just write down? Stop stalling, start starting. Go, go. So here we go. Um, this is where I am so far. I, his face is super grumpy and I, I'm, I'm loving him. I'm loving him. So this is, the first start is to do my, my line drawing. Second start is gonna be to watercolor. But after I, um, after I do this, I'm gonna take a photograph of this and then I'm gonna offer this as, um, if people wanna buy a book, I'm gonna see if I can get a watercolor book printed. So they could have watercolor pages of the drawings. They could paint them, them or color them themselves. I'll see. So, um, <laughs> the, the real star of spring fairies, well, there's going to be a lot of them, but the flowers are a big part. So I have tulip. This is a lilac bush. We're going to put daffodils in here. Let's start putting some daffodils in here. So daffodils, I'm going to take and I'm going to put, um, some little trumpets in here for daffodils. We're gonna put some little, we're gonna have the little trumpets kind of going every which way. And then we can, we can paint our daffodils. I'm gonna paint mine, I think, with orange trumpet parts. And I wanna, I really wanna do have them every which way. I'm putting my little trumpets in first. Once we paint these, you'll see that they're daffodils. 
So we're going to have daffodils. I'm going to put some specific leaves in here now to just sort of fill this in. Really pretty. Um, let's put another daffodil here. Let's make this one coming up like that. That daffodil's reaching for the sun. <laughs> okay, so uh, we're gonna have the daffodils and good morning, good morning. It's 1.37 here in France. Time check, give me a time check and give me where you are. And let's say good morning. <laughs> we are in France. It is 1.37 and Jasmine just followed. Jasmine, thank you for following. I'm really trying hard to get to 100,000 followers. I believe we can do it. And it's because people like you following. Amelia, good morning. 737 in Connecticut. 637 in Arkansas. Sunshine's in Port Orange. That's where my babies are. 737 PA. Lovely. Well, good morning and welcome. <laughs> Welcome to the chateau. Okay, so we're going to have daffodils down here. Um, I had been writing earlier. I had been putting names down in here on the live. And I'm going to do a bonjour, Sheila. I'm going to do a thing. I'm going to go look and find all of our subscribers. And I'm going to have a subscribers page on this because I want to say thank you to all of our subscribers for supporting us and believing in my art and my stuff. So I'm going to create one of my garden pictures. I'm going to write all the subscribers. See, here's like Billy, here's um, all kind of Hunter, there's Emily, there's all kinds of names that I wrote in here, but I'm going to hide these now. We're going to hide these. But I want to have a subscribers page where I do that. Oh my goodness, I just wrote on my kitty cat. Okay, is that a problem? No, I'm going to make this branch come up here off the table. <laughs> I mean, out of the picture. Because these ones are all getting mistletoe balls on them. The mistletoe up in the trees. We'll put a ball of mistletoe up to the kitty cat. It's a happy accident. <laughs> Afternoon for North, oh, 436 in California. Oh, Norfolk 1238. Wait, Norfolk. Oh, no, and you're in England. And Tracy followed. Thanks for following. And thank you, everybody who's been watching the TikToks, sharing us with your friends. You're amazing. So I could have and I should have put a swan here. I'm going to put a, no, I got swans up here. Never mind. Uh, I got my cat, got my mouse, ponies. Ponies are down in a different, not, another part of the property. But I need um, lily of the valley I have up here. So I need some hyacinths. And I think I'm going to put some tulips here because I re tulips really say spring. And I'm making these little simple, look, three little points. Three little points, that's all. Three little points. I'm going to put a whole bunch of these little three points on. And then we're going to put some other flowers up here too. I'll put some behind, some in front. <clears throat> Sorry. I hope wherever you are in this world, I hope you're getting just what you need. I hope your day is lovely. I hope it's filled with lots of smiles. Lots of creativity. I was talking to, um, there's a guy here, he's a dancer, he's awesome. I'll introduce you to him. Um, we were saying how our, our moods change when we're doing art. Our moods elevate when we're doing art. 
Breakfast was incredible. Lunch was incredible. I just had lunch. Oh my goodness. Sheila, thank you for being a cheerleader and saying tap, tap, tap. <laughs> You're lovely. But we were talking about how um, when, when we're like for him, when he's dancing, like no one can be sad if you're dancing. When you're creating art, even if you're going through a sad time, there's something that it tickles. It just tickles that creative part of your brain that just gives you this instant happy. Um, it's the t it's Sunday, and it is one forty one p.m. So we have. Uh, tulips, we have daffodils, and I want to put some little hyacinths in here, and I'm just going to do this by just doing like some little, little, they're lower to the ground, these hyacinths, but I'm going to put some of those in here. We'll, we'll make some little, probably pink hyacinths, we'll paint these pink, I imagine. I'm going to paint this today. Today I'm going to have the cover of our book done. That's, I promise you that. <laughs> that will happen. I'm not coming out of my room again until it's dinner time. I'm going to sit in here and I'm going to create my little heart out. Because this is an opportunity. Um, I'm just looking for spring flowers. So a daisy, hey Bobby, a daisy um, has not made the list. We have tulips, hyacinths, lilies, daffodils, and lilacs. And I know... There's so many more spring flowers, but I'm gonna, I'm just gonna have those, just those. That one might be a little taller, that's okay. I'm gonna put in some more leaf fields. So then, then as we get closer here, and I was just saying, I want everybody to know this, all of our subscribers, because I see we got a lot of subscribers in here. On the roof, it's swans. <laughs> I have to fix their tail feathers a little bit. And we have swans out on the the lake here. There's swans out here. Yes, that's how a swan goes. There's there's also like that one has a little flamingo neck, but it's okay. <laughs> yeah, there's crocuses too, but um we're just gonna I did this cover last night and I think I'm gonna stick with we have one, two, three, four, five kinds of fairies. The flowers are going to be turning into fairies. So down here, I'm going to take and I'm going to make some bigger ones down here. Let's put some bigger tulips in here, this part, because they're closer to us. And all these names that I had put in now, they're going to kind of be hidden, but we'll know that they're there, right? Because these are closer to us. Let's just make it a... Everybody, everybody thinks of tulips as a spring flower. I love tulips. So we'll be able to paint all of those. And then maybe here we'll put a, let's put a big hyacinth in here. And the hyacinths sort of have like all these little blooms on it. I'm gonna go ahead and this one, since it's detailed, I'm gonna put little blooms on this one. I'm, I'm so excited because so many wonderful coincidences have happened with this book so far. So many incredible coincidences have happened. <laughs> like I was drawing the mistletoe balls in the tree and I was going to look up the picture on my phone and I looked right out, look right outside my window. Right outside the chateau window, there are the trees with the mistletoe in them. <laughs> Look at that, and Carol followed, thank you. And everybody tap, tap, tap. I want everybody all around the world to be able to enjoy this experience together. We are living in a French chateau for the whole month of February with the most amazing view, most amazing room, 
most amazing food, most amazing artist. I'm going to introduce you to 25 incredible artists. And um, my desk has a painting of a of a church on top of it. And this right here, this is where we're making this happen. You're making this happen. So please share me with the whole wide world. Let's do this. Let's inspire everybody to follow their dream, get after your dream. I nag you for that, but I want you to follow your dream. Okay. Um, and our fairies are gonna come alive. They're spring, they're spring cleaning in the chateau. And my story is really evolving. My story is evolving. <laughs> I think here I might put some, let's put some of the lily of the valley here. Let's do that. Let's take a little branch up. Put some more lily of the valley in. I'm gonna put um, three because I'm gonna have three little sister fairies come to life that are lilies of the valley. Okay. Um, I don't think we can have too many tulips. I really don't. I think it's impossible to have too many tulips. What do you think? <laughs> Can we have too many flowers? Uh, all the pages are going to be this detailed. And all the pages, when I finish this, I'm going to photograph this. And then I'm going to produce two different kinds of books. One, Morton and I might have to produce ourselves. One, I might, I might do one as a special one where I print these off on watercolor paper so you could paint them yourselves. But I'm going to... I'm going to first ink it, and then we're going to paint it. <laughs> so, yeah, it's, it's going to be fun. Okay, I think I'm going to put a daffodil in here. Let's put a daffodil in here. Put a daffodil in there. We'll see it when we paint it. We'll put a daffodil here too. And you'll see the daffodil when we paint that. Oops. What happened? My phone stand. I think that's good enough. And make sure you're liking, sharing, watch the TikToks. Um, we haven't had anything yet go viral from France. We haven't even gotten a hundred new followers. I wanted I really want to do that because I want people to see this process. I want people to enjoy this journey. So share with your friends, pretty please. We'll put another, let's put another daffodil here. That's the, the trumpet of the daffodil. And let's put the petals in here. Put the stem down, put a leaf up. Put another leaf up. Painting this is gonna be so much fun. I'm going to put another tulip top here. Leaf. That's a tulip. Leaf. Leaf. Another leaf. Another leaf. Back behind here, and I kind of love that. Some of you told me names in the last live that I put names on there. I'm kind of loving that. 
And I think randomly on here, I'm going to put, because the flowers are going to turn into fairies. You know I love the whimsical. This is a fairy tale. So I'm going to put some, some of that here. I'm going to put some faces on some that you won't see. <laughs> you won't see until it happens. Okay, so I have my flowers. Oh, we need a ladybug. I have a ladybug. There's a ladybug in the chateau that visits me. And this, this is going to be like this style. We're going to watercolor this. We're going to watercolor this. Uh, do I ever put color down before ink? I do sometimes. Sometimes I do. Um, I have not seen a squirrel here. So I'm putting things that I've seen here in France. They have red squirrels here in France. So if I see red squirrels, I will add a red squirrel to this. But I want to put it like I saw a whole field of swans. I haven't seen a mouse, but I drew this guy when I was in Pennsylvania. So I kind of feel like he needs to be in here. There is a cat here at the chateau named Dusty. Dusty came and visited me last night. Dusty's definitely got to be a part of it. And I met three beautiful ponies. So the ponies are going to be part of it. But I'm not going to have them in this cover picture because it is about the fairies. It's about the fairies. Okay, a ladybug I need. I need a ladybug. And I think I'll put... I got the hiccups. I'm going to drink some water. The water here is amazing. Good morning. Or good afternoon, Jill. <laughs> Where should I put the ladybug? What do you think? How about down here, like a big ladybug down here, right in the corner? Ladybug down here. Ladybug down here with half a wing open. I kind of feel like that would be fun. Mm -hmm. No. <laughs> I got this from the basement this morning. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's vanilla yogurt. The, ba the, the caves down here dot the eye. And the eye in fairies? These are capital letters, so I'm not going to dot down here on Priscilla. <laughs> I'll dot those with two little hearts in Holiston. But these are capitals. Oh, you mean a dot the eye with a ladybug? That could be cute. What do you think? Dot the eye with a ladybug? What do you think? That's a good idea. What's everybody think? I didn't leave a whole lot of room down here for them. I could do it up here. What do you think? Yes, no, ladybug, eye, dot, tip of the cat's tail. <laughs> there, the ladybug that I had in here was climbing all over this little fellow. The ladybug's still in here somewhere, I think. Yes, on spring. On spring, just put it up here. Okay, let's do that. So it has its little head, has its little wings split. And it has one, two, three dots, one, two, three dots. This is a true ladybug. It's not the Asian ladybug. <laughs> um, Butterfly in the cat. I haven't seen a butterfly. It's the butterflies aren't out yet. Well, it's not quite spring here, but it is in our book. And I want to keep it. I want to keep it. Um, I want to keep it feeling like. Real. <laughs> it's a fairy tale, right? 
I don't think, no, ladybugs don't have antennas. Nope, nope. Okay. Um, I like how this is. I gotta, I gotta do some more details. I'm gonna put some details up on that side of the roof. Oh, we need a little chimney. Let's put a little chimney up here. Let's put a little chimney over here. Um, this is going to be like a little conservatory area. I'm going to make that line just a little bit darker. So I want to create depth right there. Like we're going into it. Um, yeah, it's still cool and crisp here, definitely. And this is just going to be a little wash of a driveway here and then green lawn. Well, green, green, well, I think we'll go with green lawn because look, there's green lawn. <laughs> the lawn is green. The lawn is green. And I'm hoping, before we leave, I'm hoping that we actually see some spring flowers blooming. Okay. Um, all right. So we have a little bench. A little bench is important. I think that's everything we need on here, I think. Now I'm gonna just sort of... do some other fields. Right here, I wanna put something in here. Um, maybe I put another, let's put a... daffodil right here. Put a daffodil right here. This is going to be white, I think, and that's going to be orange or yellow. That'll be pretty. Okay. Oh. Well, the fairies are the flowers. So they'll bloom more in the book. Um, I think that might be it. Trying to think of some other little, let's put a little, let's just put a little bear tree here. That's bare, like a little ornamental. You know, like this is like a little ornamental ring around this tree. This is our secret garden back here. I feel like this is bare. This is gonna be lawn though. And that's gonna be the, oh, I know what we need. We need this. We need a path. That's what we need. That's what we need. We need a path coming up there to the chateau. Okay, and let's put over here, let's put a little fountain. What should be in our fountain? Well, the swans are up here. The swans are up here. I gotta get these swans better. They need more of a hump on their back and less of a, there, that one's looking better. I have to clean those up. <laughs> I'm gonna have to clean those up. We got a rain barrel here for watering the garden. Uh, when you say mistletoe, is it the white berries or the green? Yep. Yep, it grows in a big ball like this, the mistletoe. Those big balls up there, let me zoom in. 
That's mistletoe. How beautiful is that? Big clumps of mistletoe. How amazing. <laughs> I was ooing and aahing about them the whole way to the chateau and here they are. Here they are. Yeah, I've seen it grow in South Carolina. I saw it down there. I don't know where else it grows. Probably grows all anywhere. It can't be too hot. And it can't be too cold. We're kind of in the southwest of France here. Uh, wishing well for fairies. Hmm. I'm gonna also put a little, I'm gonna have a little path coming around this way. There's a lot of paths here. And I just wanna, I just wanna give it this, these feels. What do we think? Let's focus on this. Uh, parasitic plant. Yeah, it grows in the trees when the air is really, really clean. And they're also poisonous. Um, whatever we put there would have to be very little. Oh, maybe, maybe this could be, let's do this. Let's not have it that, let's have it a flower bed. Let's go in here with our tulips. When I say spring flower, which one is your favorite? Which spring flower is your favorite? We'll put some little, we'll put grass in here too. Put those down first and then we'll put our leaves. And I want to put some little grass fields with my pen. Let's put little lines here. And then here, let's put, let's put a little, let's put some little grass fields up here by the path. Right, because this is gonna be lawn. So we're just going to put some little grass fields. This is the road. This is the path. I'm going to put another, another, it's kind of going to be like a little board sticking there. And they do this to keep the gravel in place. Because out here, it's like we're walking on gravel out here. It's not pavement, it's gravel. I want that to be wiggly. So when I did straight. I love that. I love that and I kind of want to stop there. Let's look at this. Oh, I got my, <laughs> I got my cords so.
completely weird <laughs> and wrapped around. Um, let's look at the covers. So, The Real Jack Frost, Lady of the Leaves. This has to be in pale greens. Definitely pale greens, pale, pale, pale greens. I want these books to lay beautifully together. Um, yeah. It's my favorite covers. <laughs> I love the other ones, but I love this one. Jill, thank you. And thank you, Sheila. Okay, so... And I'm pretty sure I have 24 illustrations in each of these. This one's longer. This one's definitely longer. I'm going to read part of Lady of the Leaves to people while I'm here. We have a literary evening, and I'm going to read. you got to read something that you wrote. I think I'm going to read just the part of Lady of the Leaves. I, I think the covers are going to look so pretty together. So I think this is going to be, I'm going to paint this, I'm going to paint this um, like a pale spring green. Thanks, Kathleen. It already tells the story. I want to, because I did put people's names in here, <laughs> and I'm going to do a subscribers page in here where I do a garden where I put your names in. Like I have Maggie, Alexander, Morton, Sarah, Jimmy, Bonbon. Bon. I need to put, I need to put Graham and Erica in here too. I'm naughty. I'm going to put in, well, see the roads aren't cobblestone here. This is how the roads are in France. It's, they're just, they're pebbles. They're pebbles and they're natural. They're almost like a little dusty thing. Yeah. There aren't, there aren't cobblestones here. Yeah, the hidden names. Bobby, um, all the family members are going to have their names hidden on one of these pages. So, um, but here, I think what I'm going to do, because i got to put, let's put Erica right here.